clear at the last type of graphs, the edge weighted and directed graphs. These are uh, pretty similar to edge weighted graphs, except uh, now each of the edge along with weight has a direction associated with them. So uh, the definition of uh, edge has uh, changed. Uh, it, even though it uh, still contains uh, 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 two vertices, uh, but the, now there is a direction associated uh, with the vertex. So programmatically, uh, this will uh, change as follows. Uh, the edge, uh, the definition of edge uh, will still contain, will still require uh, two vertices, but uh, will will have to associate a direction as with them. So I'll call this as a from vertex and uh, to vertex. The now uh, we have associated a direction now uh, with the edge, and uh, I'll rename uh, them as well. Uh, the instance variables from to and from. The vertex uh, definition uh, will still stay the same. Uh, it, the vertex will still contain a list of uh, edges uh, that are adjacent to it. The definition for graph uh, will more or less remain the same, except the way in which uh, the edges are being added uh, will change. Uh, since there is a direction associated with it, so the f the first uh, the first vertex. Uh, in the from vertex and uh, the second vertex in the two vertex, uh, we won't be adding uh, this line to our uh, edge weighted di directed graph. So let me create a class called edge weighted uh, directed directed graph. And uh, the only difference between uh, these two classes will be uh, in terms of uh, the edge add edge method. Uh, so let me. Let me make this to directed graph. Okay. The only difference will be you won't be adding the edge to vertices of W. Uh, there is a direction associated with this. And uh, let me rename this to from and uh, rename this to to. That is what uh, the definition of add, add edge will mean from now. And uh, given a vertex, I uh, will still be returning a list of uh, its adjacent uh, edges. Uh, now, uh, coming to our test case, our edge weighted uh, directed graph uh, will will still test it with uh, three vertices. Uh, the first vertex uh, will be from zero to one, which contains a weight of three. And uh, let's uh, test it out for vertex two. Ideally, we, there is no edge uh, starting from vertex 2, so we should not be getting any output. Uh, so let's run it and uh, let's check. Uh, we did not get any output. Let's run it for uh, vertex 0. Uh, so we should be getting uh, this uh, first edge and uh, this edge, uh, the two edge, one with uh, weight 3 and one with weight 10. So let's uh, run it and uh, check if we are getting uh, that as the output. Yes we are getting the output. 